Well, I like to think of myself as a you know reasonably competent wool at war game player. Uh, maybe I'm not, but this is one of those uh, tricky little scenarios that uh, Mark or uh, someone has designed that uh, for World at War here that is difficult. And I'm playing the new uh, Eisenbach Gap Deluxe. And this scenario has a small force of infantry uh, loaded up in martyrs. Well, they don't have to be loaded up, but you can load them up in martyrs. Uh, so just two platoons and uh, two, uh, two martyr units. And it looks attached to the uh, tanks over here, these Leopard 2s, which are awesome. They're part of the uh, 3174th West German forces. But they face off against a fairly uh, fairly tough foe, the second airborne, which have great morale and an anti tank gun and three companies uh, or three platoons. I forget what scale this is, it doesn't matter. <laughs> three companies, whatever. Uh, I think it's platoons, three platoons. Uh, so I have one here, one here to start with, and I put one back over here, actually here, and then we moved it one hex uh, with the mortar, 81 millimeter mortar. And uh, then uh, almost a full uh, formation of uh, the first uh, first tank, you know, a whole bunch of T-72s, which have you know, really crappy save rolls, but pretty good attack. So what I thought, on my first time I played, I, I ran the infantry up this way and I sent the tanks around that way, and that didn't work out very well. It was over in three or four turns. Uh, uh, four turns, yeah. And this time I thought I'll, I'll, I'll bring all my forces this way, but I'll try and soften things up first using the... Uh, two artillery strikes, one which is an HE uh, strike and the other which is an anti-tank, basically, uh, strike. Um, but no luck so far. In fact, I, I sat back here and fired a double range, which is why I was posting on uh, BGG and uh, Facebook asking about double range for HE weapons uh, for the soft attack values. Uh, but you can indeed fire double range and that would make it two sixes. Uh, to hit, which is not a super good uh, good result, you know, try and hit something. But if you're with an HQ, that's four sixes to hit. That's not too bad. So, uh, you know, we tried that. Uh, Soviets just moved a tank up here and just knocked the crap out of me. Uh, they've disrupted and reduced uh, the Marty unit there. Uh, we got lucky with a long-range shot and reduced this infantry unit and the HQ uh, for second airborne rolled really badly, and uh, they they were reduced as well. So woohoo, we we for me. But this this guy rolls two sixes. Let me just zoom in on that little guy because I hate this little freaking unit. This is the second time in the scenario that this has been the cause of the problem. Two sixes. So we're here. Move one. Opportunity fire. Two sixes. We're in half range. So it's two fives. Use the HQ, it's three fives, he rolls two hits. So this guy's dead. So that's your that's your offense pretty much done. Uh, you can try and close assault with these tanks if this guy's reduced. When I say these tanks, I'll bring up uh, these martyrs. I could try and close assault with those, but that's just gonna get ugly. And uh, uh, the, <laughs> so I'm gonna start again, annoying. Uh, there must, must be a way to solve this little puzzle. I'm gonna go work it out. Talk to you soon.